Data scanned. Downloading files. We've gotten some potentially incriminating evidence and some big corporate negligence. And a suggestion that someone was closer to a cure than we thought. But we need to find the person that evidence came from. And we're looking for a possible whistleblower, a, a Vexix employee named Judy Walters. Her last known location was Vexix HQ. Give me that! Screw you! My kid needs food! Not my problem! Sorry, sir, but I'm gonna have to ask you to move. We're just trying to dry off. Give us a break. Okay, I'm sorry, but you'll have to take your things and vacate the area. This They're is private not monsters, property and Mr. you're obstructing Velassi. traffic. I'm going to try and persuade here, them Come again. On, Judy, this is a story whether you persuade them or not. But listen, listen. You don't have to go on the air with this, but if you can at least get me some kind of proof. Active Echo Beacon detected. Hang on. Mr. Velassi, I meant it. I'm not talking until I God, give them another chance to there. do the right thing. And I you know, I thought of taking the day off and calling in sick. But if you don't, I'll be waiting outside to get you out. I'm live on the air at 7. Readings indicate an echo nearby. power and resources, we'd have that cure. Guess I thought that maybe, just maybe, we'd put humanity first.
Miss Miss Walters, I need you to wait. Let go of me. No, I'm not kidding. Shh. It literally just happened right in front of me. Jesus, Rick. Without her, this whole story's a bust. Maybe we run with the Directive 51 thing. You know anything on that? No, but no. This story isn't over yet. You damn that didn't end well. Whether or not Vex6 was sitting on a potential cure, that USB drive could have been the breakthrough we needed. I'll see if I can track down this Rick Velassi character. Thanks, Agent.